Did you know that one family has produced some of the greatest mathematicians in history? Welcome to Mathematic, where today we'll explore the life and legacy of Jacob Bernoulli, one of the pioneering members of the famous Bernoulli family. Jacob Bernoulli was born on December 27, 1654, in Basel, Switzerland. He was one of the first members of the Bernoulli family to gain fame as a mathematician and is known for his contributions to calculus, probability theory, and the discovery of the mathematical constant E. Jacob's early life was marked by a strong family influence towards academic excellence. Initially, he studied theology at his family's insistence and entered the ministry, but his passion for mathematics and natural sciences soon took over. From 1676 to 1682, Jacob traveled throughout Europe, learning about the latest discoveries in mathematics and the sciences from leading figures of the time, including Johannes Huda, Robert Boyle, and Robert Hooke. Jacob Bernoulli made significant contributions to several areas of mathematics. Along with his brother Johann, he was one of the founders of the calculus of variations. He introduced the concept of the Bernoulli numbers, which are deeply connected to number theory and mathematical series. Additionally, Jacob discovered the fundamental mathematical constant E while studying compound interest. His most important work was in the field of probability. In his book, Ars Conjectandi, published posthumously in 1713, Jacob laid down the first version of the law of large numbers, which is a fundamental principle in the field of probability. Bernoulli numbers are a sequence of rational numbers that play a significant role in number theory and are used in various areas of mathematical analysis. For example, they appear in the expansion of the tangent and hyperbolic tangent functions and in the Euler-Maclaurin formula, which connects integrals and sums. Jacob Bernoulli's Law of Large Numbers states that as the size of a sample increases, the average of the sample becomes closer to the expected value. This principle is fundamental in statistics and is used to predict outcomes over large data sets. For instance, if you flip a coin many times, the proportion of heads and tails will get closer to 50% as the number of flips increases. In 1683, Jacob Bernoulli discovered the constant E by studying a question about compound interest. He found that the value of the expression 1 plus 1 over n to the power of n approaches a limit as n becomes very large. This limit is the number E approximately equal to 2.71828. The discovery of E was a significant milestone in mathematics, especially in the study of exponential growth and decay. Jacob Bernoulli was just one member of the illustrious Bernoulli family. His younger brother, Johann Bernoulli, also made significant contributions to mathematics, and their combined work helped lay the groundwork for many future developments in the field. The Bernoulli family produced many prominent mathematicians over several generations, each building upon the work of their predecessors. Here are some fun facts about Jacob Bernoulli. He sided with Gottfried Wilhelm Leibniz during the Leibniz-Newton calculus controversy and was an early proponent of Leibnizian calculus. Jacob was one of the first to use the term integral in calculus. He inscribed the Latin phrase idem mutata resurgo on his tombstone, meaning I shall arise the same though changed, along with a logarithmic spiral, symbolizing his belief in the perpetual and unending cycle of life. However, an Archimedean spiral was engraved instead. Jacob Bernoulli's work has stood the test of time, shaping the way we understand probability, calculus, and the concept of exponential growth. Thank you for joining us today. See you next time on Mathematic.